So welcome back to my channel. This is Gamer Dom, and this is well. First of all, it's a huge rarity. I am actually top tier. Yay, fanfare! Da, 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 da. Yeah, fanfare. Um, I am <laughs> only ever seem to get top tier these days in a Type Four heavy. Um, so we're on Corellia. Um, it's a an assault game, and I'm reminding the team right at the beginning: defend, right? Defend. Because how many times do you play this mode and your entire team goes screaming off down the south and down the north and they get killed and if they just sat back and let the enemy come you might have had a chance. So I like to try and remind people they largely ignore it because hey it's random battles world of tanks. Um, and ideally if I was in a slightly bigger tank a bit slightly faster tank uh, sorry I would go up to a eight and sit there um, but this is the Japanese ultimate super obese well sort of super obese so, sort of <laughs> ultimate because it is only the tier 9 and the tier 10 is even better so this thing is a big old beastie but it is very very slow and I was fully expecting that Oho to be absolutely annihilated as he headed across there because it has happened to me before now when I've headed up there and there's been an enemy scout and all the TDs that inevitably, inevitably are lined up along the top of the crest of the hill then just blast the bejesus out of you. But he got away with it and I'm now wondering should I have gone? But too late now, there's no way I can get across now. Um, so I'm just going to sit here and provide um, fire, fire support like an artillery does. Because kind of this is what this gun is all about. 150 millimeter HE firing gun and it's just fun all the people who think HE is ruining the game <laughs> up your bottoms don't care it's fun what's ruining the game is people spamming premium rounds not HE anyway enough of my little rant rantette wasn't really a rant so you can see I haven't done an awful lot. I'm just come here, sat behind me rock. There are there is an artillery uh, in place, so I don't want to push too far around. I know that if I push up I will be spotted. This thing is the size of a continent and therefore you cannot afford to be spotted. So and it is a defend game, right? I don't have to. Oh there we go, customer. Finally somebody to take on and I put a nice shell into the side of him. 396 damage and knock his tracks off. Can someone finish him off please? No. Okay. There's too much to ask for. I know. I know. Just too much to ask for. But keep an eye on that um, that uh, IS-6. So I did... Uh, oh, I missed... Braced, I wasted that shot. So that IS-6 is on 47 health. Keep an eye on him. Missed, I've raced, um, wasted that shot on the E75, should have aimed more, but he was about to disappear in the gully and I just didn't want to waste the chance to have at least a shell out. And you never know, sometimes you just get lucky with those sort of shots. The only trouble is the reload on this 20 seconds long, so you don't really want to go wasting shells. And you can see here, I'm just trying not to, and then that shell dips. Trying not to waste the shell, but hey, what can you do? So... Take a shot from the IS-3, he's going to be lucky to pen me from here. There's WZ has come round. I've got a premium shell with extra splash loaded here. Can we hit him? Come on, just a little bit more. Just a little bit. He's on 334 da 336 damage. There we go, there's the shot. And did you see that? Double kill. Double kill. IS-6. And the VK, so the splash damage finished off that 40 health on the, on the IS-6. So there you go, Bombardier medal secure. I didn't realise I was going to get it, but I did. Still, we've got a game to no good congratulating myself. Not that I even noticed during the game. Um, we've got a, we've got a game to win, and it's tight. It's five plays three. And there you go, the RT have decided they want to try and take me out, even though I'm stuck right behind the rock, so didn't really do any damage to me, but did stun me because of the new mechanics that everybody 
forced to going to bring in because they whinged about artillery. Um, so we're now we're okay with six place three. This is looking reasonably good. I'm reloaded. There is a super Pershing in the middle there somewhere. There he is, and there is the uh, E75. So I'm coming around here, going to see what I can do to support, make sure that uh, Super Pershing can't push up. Can't seem to get a shot on him, but for somehow I'm managing getting assistance damage. I'm not quite sure how that works. I was behind a rock, and um, he was spotted before I appeared, and yeah, he got assistance for me. I'm not going to argue, it's more credits to me, but it does seem a bit bizarre. So, I'm waiting for him to die. And there he goes. Right, so now we can move. We haven't done anything, we've just been a mobile pillbox for most of the game so far. There's only four minutes left. Um, we are 7-3 up. 7-4 up, 8-4 up. There we go. And I'm going after that uh, E75. If we can take him out, if me and the Lerf can take him down, then this flank is pretty much secure. So we know he's in the gully. There he is, hello my beauty. Bang, straight in the back of the turret, 411 damage, but I did hit by a Borsig out on the hill, 500 damage, not so good. So I'm backing away, backing away. You can see there's a couple of light tanks in the cap. Reloaded, take a speculative shot at that bulldog, but didn't manage to hit him, unfortunately. Probably should have aimed for the ground with him, um, continuing the artillery theme, because he was on such low health, the splash probably would have killed him. I'm taking a chance, I'm pretty sure I'm not spotted anymore, um, and that Borsig won't be able to hit me, because he won't be able to see me, without the help of that uh, E75 that spotted me, first of all. So we can move back into the middle. Games have come back online a bit. It's 10 place 7. Yeah, there's an object 704, but he's a bit stuck. Uh, bat chat, or the 12 ton bat chat takes out their enemy bulldog, so it's 11 place 7. So we should be good. It's only two minutes left of the game. I'm pulling back. I don't want the Lerv and the Scorpion are going after cheap kills. But I'm worried about that VK that's up there on the other flank. He could be problematic. The object should be able to deal with him, but the Jag Panther 2 is on 32 health, so that's not so good. But there goes their enemy artillery, so that's good. And that was a team kill, I think? Yes. That was a team kill, so just what you need in the games going on really well. Nice shot into the side of the Jag Tiger. Another 400 health. For the derp. Derp is good. Can we get another shot on him before he disappears down into the gully? He's going after the light tank, because, you know, why wouldn't you? Instead, let's see if we can take out a VK. Aiming where he was before. Didn't manage to hit him. That should have hit. Should have hit, but it didn't manage to. Only a minute and 30 seconds left. For some reason that Jag Tiger's going after the 12 ton. I suppose he couldn't cap out, so he might as well go and get some cheap kills. And cheap farm some cheap damage. Oh, 704 jumps down on him and takes him out. The boss, there's our friend in the Borsig. Can we get a shot on him? Could have had a shot there, but I didn't want to. I didn't want to hit our scorpion and then I couldn't be sure. The problem with the 20 second reload gun is it's not always easy. Uh, and I thought he was coming around the s one side and he wasn't, he was around the other side. So, I'm not going to do an awful lot more. Only 1100 damage, uh, sorry, 1200 damage and 1200 blocked. But we have got a bombardier medal in a Type 4 Heavy. <laughs> so, where's that BK? Oh, there's the Borsig again. Can we get a shot on him? No, he's down. Can we finish it in style with a with a shot on that VK? 704 is moving over. Oh, there he is. Talk of the devil. There he is. Top of the turret. Nice. GG. Game over. We win. So there you go. Third class. Spotter. 
<laughs> type 4 heavy bruiser which is more normal than a type 4 heavy and look at that bombardier medal awarded to a player who destroys two or more vehicles with one shot so i got that uh, wz and the is6 with one shot in a heavy tank <laughs> well it's not just like any other normal heavy tank is it it's more like a artillery on its on firing firing horizontal uh we did 1762 damage three kills 861 base xb that object had a good game 4000 damage so did the love 3000 damage so they played very very well indeed fired 10 shots hit with six uh also got some splash i wonder who that was on um blocked 780 is nothing in this thing and we got 1200 assistance 35000 credits uh, 12000 profit because i did fire one um premium he shell just one and look at that destroyed my profitability on this tank but hey it's a win and i'll take a win 3876 experience with the times three of the day so that my friends is how you get a bombardier medal in a heavy tank ever done it let me know if, what's the strangest medal you've got in a tank um, that really shouldn't get it i mean like getting spotter medal in a heavy tank certainly get a bombardier medal you shouldn't get it but there's some weird things that happen in this game so let me know if you see anything like that or you've had it happen to you in the meantime please click like and subscribe if you did and you want to and in the meantime enjoy your games have fun try not to take it too seriously it's just a damn game after all and i'll see you again soon this is gamer dime gamer this is gamer dom signing out <laughs>